jury is now investigating the shooting death of an eight-year-old, Fanta Balili. The ballistics report says the little girl was killed by Sharon Hill police. Officers opened fire on August 27th outside a high school football game when a confrontation between several men escalated into gunfire. Jasmine Payut spoke with the family's attorney, and she joins us now outside Academy Park High with their message. Jasmine. Yuki, good evening. As the family continues to grieve, their attorney says new developments are giving them and the community hope that justice will be served. We want the respect of we're sorry. Calls for action in more ways than one as community members gathered at a press conference organized by the Delaware County Black Caucus. We need to train our officers so that something that happened on August 27th never happens again. The organizers met Thursday calling for the officers involved in the deadly shooting of eight year old Fant's ability to not only speak out, but to be fired and held accountable. Investigators say ballistic. Concluded she was killed by shots fired by Sharon Hill officers outside of the Academy Park football stadium. Obviously, the family members are concerned about who set this all in motion, whether the police acted unreasonably, and whether they faced criminal charges. Uh, and they're not happy at all with Sharon Hill. Former Montgomery County District Attorney Bruce Castor is representing the Billity family. He says he's been in meetings with both the Delaware County District Attorney and Kelly Hodge, the former Philadelphia well, District Attorney, looking into Sharon Hill Police Department policies. He says they are pleased with new information. The DA will be impaneling a grand jury to investigate. What we can deduce is the grand jury would not be uh, used unless the DA had run up against roadblocks of people who were not cooperating. Castor says two other people were injured when officers opened fire near those Friday night lights. According to reports, the officers fired after hearing gunshots nearby and began shooting at a vehicle that turned directly in front of them. But the reality is that no matter the outcome of the grand jury, this was a gross and negligent act. We also learned that the Pensbury High School football team, Academy Park, was playing the night of the shooting, has stepped in to help out. They started a fundraiser where part of the proceeds will go to the Billity family. We'll have that information on our website, cbsphilly.com. We're live in Sharon Hill, Jasmine Payute, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Jasmine, thank you.